You likely felt the impact of supply chain issues as well as inflation at the grocery store. And the same goes for most food banks. The Regional Food Bank of Oklahoma is feeling it as they head into their busiest months trying to provide for hungry Oklahomans. News 4's Lauren Daniels has more. From the road to the warehouse, supply chain issues are impacting us all. There's not enough drivers for the semi trucks. There's not enough warehouse workers to help move product and get it out. Kathy Neslin with the Regional Food Bank of Oklahoma says they're not experiencing or expecting a food shortage. However, getting food hasn't been as easy or as affordable. Once we secure it as well, we're seeing a really much longer delay on delivery, up to eight weeks even at times. In addition to that, we're paying double, if not triple, in freight cost. In the early days of this pandemic, we saw long lines of Oklahomans and Americans really across the country lined up to receive help from food banks. While Neslin says that has slowed, the need, which is a constant in our state, grows in the winter months. It's concerning because Oklahoma is the fifth hungriest state in the nation. So we're just buckling down and, and making sure that we continue to be efficient. So how can you help ensure your fellow Oklahomans can feed themselves and their families? Neslin says financial and food donations, particularly canned vegetables, are always welcome. If you don't have the cash to give, she says you can always give the gift of time as a volunteer. That saves us labor costs. So you can come out and help sort and pack food and guarantee that you have a good time doing it as well. Lauren Daniels, Oklahoma's News 4.